Hey guys, it's Wolf Lobes here. I'm very excited for this video. Make sure that you watch this whole video because in this video I will share the most bullish thing that I have ever, ever seen in my life for cryptocurrencies. Ever. I've been in this since late 2016 and this is the most bullish thing that I have ever seen. And guys, I thought that this bull run is going to be huge. But this bull run is going to be huge times freaking 100,000 million, million billions. Because let me show, I'm, uh, the thing that I'm going to show you will blow your mind, guaranteed. Because do you know what? I just read an article that 35% of all USD has been printed in the last 10 months. 35% of the whole USD supply has been printed in the last 10 months. And you can see this as stimulus checks. The inflation tra rate is, has been going like boom, boom, boom. And the last 10 months, it's, it's like this. Okay. And what does it mean when the they, when, when US, US prints so much dollars or any currency? It means that the buying power of the currency will get lower. Okay. You will need more USD to buy, you know, stuff. And what this does with cryptocurrencies mean that, let me show you, this is just going to blow your mind. Now you might think that um, we are in the bull run. Like you can see, yeah, the price is here and the price in back 2070 was here. And yeah, we have passed the all-time high, but we haven't. We have not passed the all-time high in terms of buying power of USD. Look at this. So this is BS, uh, Bitcoin USD slash M1. What is M1? M1 is chart, the stock market adjusted for the US dollar money supply. Okay, so in terms of buying power, we have still not passed the 2017 bull run. Like even though Bitcoin price is $57,000, the buying power of people buying it now is the same as buying it back in 2017 all-time highs. Okay, so that being said, we have not even, the bull run haven't, has not even started. All this bumping is because of US printing more dollars. I know that it's not like that black and white, that it's Bitcoin is like whole, uh, it's not only US, US is not the central center of the world. But look at this. Just look at this. I think that Bitcoin is going to go in so... In, it's going to go so much up that people won't even believe it. I think that when the real bull run hits, it's going to go absolutely crazy. Just absolutely crazy. Because the, there's currently Bitcoin, there's there's not that much Bitcoin left. Okay? And I think that this is extremely bullish. I think that the bull run hasn't even started yet. When... when Jesus Christ, when the real bull run starts, I think that Bitcoin is going to go astronomical numbers, just just crazy numbers. And I don't think, even though Bitcoin is going to go up a lot, I don't think that buying now Bitcoin is not good. Even, but, but if you have a lot of money, like if you have a crazy amount of money to put in it, I think that it's safe bet. And I think that Bitcoin is like the safe, <laughs> safe cryptocurrency because, yeah, it's just, that's, that's how the cryptocurrencies are. Currently, people see it, but when the Bitcoin does like 10 x from here, I think that the other coins do like thousand x. There's going to be, <laughs> it's going to be absolutely massive. I love that data is running again. Data is just massive project. I don't totally like data is just crazy, but anyway. So with that being said, I'm very extremely bullish on cryptocurrencies. Like very bullish. Like you can see here. The bull run hasn't even started yet. We haven't even crossed the all-time high in terms of buying power. Look at here. Look at here. We are in the same 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 exact line. So this is like uh <laughs> it's funny because people like yeah the bull run is there, yeah, that's the bull run, it's over. And I was like the, the, but then I, when I saw this, I was like, wait a minute. Wait a minute. We haven't even started yet. Like we the bull run haven't hasn't even started yet. <laughs> <laughs> and I like I almost cried after like seeing that because but I almost like cried because US has started printing so much more money 
like it's insane it's 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 going to there they just want to at this point they are just going to ruin usd they're just going to print so much of it that it's going to they print faster than people can spend it basically <laughs> i think that's funny in a sense it's not funny because it's people's money but it's just funny because what the fuck is going on <laughs> like what the hell is going on like how it's how how it's allowed to print that much money like what how it's like they are just ruining people like think about who, someone who has been sp like saving up usd from like uh when he started working you from us united states and he's been saving dollar the value has been just going down and 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 down it's crazy it's just absolutely crazy and it makes me mad that they, there, there are people playing with other people's money but from the ashes we rise i think that cryptocurrencies are the like the massive hedge against any kind of money printing also i look at uh if you go and look at euros i'm 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 from europe uh euros inflation rate i think that that shit is just going to do they, they just <laughs> i don't know i <clears throat> it's just crazy how much uh how how like <laughs> It's crazy. I think that cryptocurrencies are going to change the world. It's the technology is there. I, th I think that in general, people in cryptocurrencies are very like... Um, um, I like that people are nice. Like in a sense, of course, there's some money... Hung like, of course, greed is... Greed, envy and fear. These kind of emotions are very, very uh, burden to our hearts. But I think that in general, people in cryptocurrencies are very open-minded. Um, I think that we, are, we are a generation here. Where I think that one of my, my audience is like mostly 25 slash 34 year old. Anything between that, anything under that, I just love it. There's not that many old people watching, but those old people who are watching, and by old I mean maybe like over 60 year old. I think that that's amazing that the people have steeped their toes in the cryptocurrencies. Cryptocurrencies are very volatile and this is not investment advice. This is just something that I was like, this blew my mind. Look at this. I'm still uh, like, look at this. The, it's still the same as being in the bull run in 2020. Uh, sorry, not 2020, but 2017 and 2018 in terms of buying power. Because <laughs> the dollar value is not... <laughs> it's just... It just goes down. So even though the Bitcoin prices has gone up, um, you know, it's still not like. But anyway, let me show you. Also, so copper price. Um, so copper is used. Um, a lot in everything. So like you can see, copper has been mooning lately. Copper has been. Look at this. Copper has been just mooning, okay, from four dollars to like ten bucks almost. That is huge. That is huge because because um dollar valuation is just you know they are just going to print it to death, okay. So people are just looking for investments that could say like um they, where they don't lose their money. Like gold is gold is like um uh, uh for example gold gold is not to make like I I like people like always say why the fuck who you, like who would invest in gold instead of like Bitcoin like there's no sense and I understand that but you have to also understand that gold and silver prices are very suppressed and also gold is not to make money gold is to just you know acquire wealth because gold is God's money okay you know like. When you buy gold, it's not going to necessarily going to up like five, it's not going to go up fifty thousand percent, but it's going to uh, have its value after ten years, twenty years, okay? Because it's God's money. So, I think that gold and silver still. Are, I I don't currently own any gold and silver, but I think gold and silver are also very good. Also, digital uh, assets because the, you can't print more of those, and there are also hype and all this stuff. So, but anyway. I think that we are very early. We are in the like in the midst of huge revolution. I love it. I love to be part of this kind of revolution. I want to I want to make the world a better place. So I'm very excited for all this. 
Um, even though, even though there's people who suffer from this money printing, I we suffer, uh, we all suffer from it, of course, because we all are using fiat currencies. But we can make the change. We can make change here. I don't know how the change is going to happen, but whatever happens, let's just you know keep our heads up, smile, and enjoy our time here. Okay. Thank you so much for watching. If you found this video helpful, subscribe to my channel and like this video. You can find a lot of cool stuff in the description. Check it out. Thank you so much and see you in the next video. Uh, I highly recommend you check out my free newsletter. I will do daily uh, emails there. Awesome stuff. I send you all kinds of crazy, crazy cool cryptocurrency related stuff. So see you there also. So thank you.